everybody, it's Jonathan, a.k.a. Senor Smoke, or uh, mistake, actually the appliance dude. That is my nom de guerre when uh, discussing appliances. Of course, Senor Smoke when dealing with the world of outdoor kitchens and grills. Um, welcome to Curdo's the, uh, and the sanctuary for all things related to appliance knowledge. And the reason I decided to make this video is I recently have worked with a number of customers and consummated a uh, number of sales where the customers were, uh, they bought Viking ranges, but there was some uh, question about which of the 30 inch ranges to go with. Now, uh, we're talking about the professional series here, not the three series. So folks need to decide between the open burner VGIC model, that's that heritage anniversary edition they bought back a couple years ago with the open burners. That piece at $39.99, I've told people it's a home run. You're getting the free dishwasher with it, $39.99 for what is a Viking. Okay, um, it's a great move. However, however, when you juxtapose it against the other Viking 30-inch Pro Range, which is the VGR 5304, from my nomenclature is correct. Um, that model right now, and I'm doing this on December 19th, I think is like in the mid fours or 46, something along those lines. Price increase coming in January, January 1st, I believe. Um, the six to $700 swing, I think, is something that needs to be overlooked. And in my opinion, Unless you are a builder, somebody doing a house flip, I don't see the VGIC playing along the same fields as the VGR 5304. I really dug deep into both of these models, and if it was my house, I would be all over the VGR 5304, over the VGIC. And let me break it down to you why so. Number one, number one, if you look inside the oven can, you're getting two telescopic slide-out racks on the VGR 5304, okay? On the VGIC open burner, and instead of getting into the VG this or the VGR that, I'll just call that one the open burner range, you're not getting any slide racks with it. You can Maybe you can buy one as an accessory, I don't know, um, but the oven racks are kind of like, you know, stiff to pull out. Um, the oven is far more usable, in my opinion, on the VGR 5304, the, uh, the Pro Series. Again, I used the model number, I said I wasn't going to do that. But the, uh, also, the Pro Series 5304 um, has the, uh, the dampened hinges on the door. So the door closes nice and slow on the, um, on the open burner model. If you try to close it with your foot, if your you know, hands are full with a tray or something like that, crash. It, it closes in a very, very loud fashion. Now, the differences become even more stark when you get to the top, to the range top. On the open burner range, we have old school open burners, which as is wont with, uh, with open burners. You're going to start to get some food byproducts that get down there, so you're going to have to clean. you got the drip tray. Um, some folks have an issue cleaning them, some folks not so much. On the, uh, the current sealed burner range, uh, they're sealed, right? So nothing's going to get down. Everything's going to stay on top of the uh, easy-to-clean porcelain cooking surface. Also, the burners, all right, the burners have more output on the, uh, the sealed burner range. And the burners, if you excuse me for a second, the burners have this, the brass. Okay, we like brass. They look good, first of all. But also, brass is going to hold up better under high heat. That front left burner is going to put out 18,500 BTUs. They're lower powered on the VGIC model. Um, the, uh, the broilers are the same. Uh, the broilers both use an infrared uh, gas broiler that is under a, a ceramic, um, a ceramic uh, netting, whatever you want to call it. So that's, they both have very solid broilers. But um, I also like the fact that on the current seal burner, they changed the knobs to that sexy carbon, uh, I don't know what we call it, black graphite carbon something around the lake, really smoking, and you don't get that on the, uh, on the VGIC model. So um, my vote, even with the price delta 
you go to the sealed burner range. It's just eminently more usable and food for thought. I had a woman in here on Sunday. And she cooks a hell of a lot. And while she was definitely drawn to the price point of the open burner, she just said that with the way she cooks, the price was just was not going to be an issue. Go with the seal burner. It has more, brings more to the table, and um, actually kind of dug the, uh, the look on it as well. So anyway, remember both of these stoves do, do get you into the free dishwasher or free microwave, whatever. Um, whatever you need. I actually have a lot of folks who actually don't do the free dishwasher. They'll buy the 30 inch range and they'll do the free 30 inch convection microwave above it to use as a hood. Any questions, please email me Jonathan at Curtis.com or if you're in Westchester or parts surrounding us, please visit. Uh, we are here to help and not rob you. Uh, that's about it. I will see you guys soon before the New Year's. I just don't know if it's going to be another appliance video or if I'm delving back into the world of outdoor. We will see. Thank you.